Right then, there's the, the potholers place over there. Very busy today, it was empty yesterday, it was misty. I've already bumped in some potholers a minute ago, three of them, off to Swildon's Hole. But as I've come over here, and look down there, there, that's evidence of an entrance to a pothole there, look. That's what it looks like when there's a way down. See? Whether it's a sealed one or... But it'd be sealed, they're always um, locked up. But Here's my way around now. I forgot my stick today, by the way, but... Um, it doesn't matter, I don't really need it today. I know, I, it's not, well it shouldn't really be such a massive walk, in theory. I'm just finishing off the bit I didn't do yesterday, basically. And still exploring, by the way. Still exploring. I haven't decided yet how I'm going to do it all. But what I want to be able to do is end up on the top where I saw the, the stile to go down towards the upper Jerston farm. Like I said, I'll have a look on the map and, and we'll point out the correct name for it eventually. Now because that's very squelchy there, I'm going to climb over the gate, which is less squelchy. Right, just put that there a minute. Here. And here I am everyone. This is Sheila out in the beautiful Somerset countryside. And there's a cow looking at me inside. There's a bull. First cow I've seen there locked up in there, see? There he is, that's a Young cow, I think. Locked up for the winter. Thinking, oh, you're in my field. What are you doing in my field, it's saying. I mean, it might be allowed to be out yet, I don't know. For all I know, that cow could come around the corner in a minute and get me. And that'll put an end to this particular walk I'm doing if that happens. Yeah, because I went down that way where there's a white house. Right over there. There's a white house. Now, I normally take a footpath close to that white house. And I'm going over that way, right? And across lots of fields. Oh, there's some more cows. It's right, they're fenced in. But today... Hi, Moose! I'll just, I'll just zoom in on them. Because I'm in their field and they know it. They'd like to chase me. Look at that, look at them all waiting. Right, so I'm going this way, it's designated, I can see signs. And I'm going to end up on a track over there, which I have seen before, by the way. I have seen it. <sighs> but, so you do have to go on this stretch of road. <sighs> to get to that. So, and that road's very busy, by the way. So, like I said, those cows are all kept in at the moment. Now I've got no idea where I've got this. The, this is what happens. You'll see a sign and a stile and then you don't know whether you've got to go through there to get out or down the bottom. But I can see a path. I can see a path. So that's always a sign. But we just have a look in here just in case there's a public footpath sign this side. And there isn't. Here's another little hamlet, look. All these little hamlets lead back down to um, Cheddar. There's the postman coming down the track now. 
There's two tracks, so I don't know which one I've got to come down yet. So this is all exploring, and um, you need two days to do it really, because I would, there's no way I would have been able to do both the tracks. <sighs> Yesterday, I mean, the way in could even be there. We'll find out in a minute. When we get down here, we'll find out. Hopefully it is signposted. Right, I'm going to turn off for a minute. Take some photos, so then come back on when I've found out where the route is. Over and out. <laughs>